Hi, I'm Claire and I'm part of the sales team here at Donaim at Leisure Kingdom and I'm going to take you around our latest caravan that's going for sale on the pitch. It's a 2018 Bailey Unicorn Madrid and it's a really nice caravan. So let's take a closer look at the outside. As we look to the front, we can see that it's got the Alco stabilised hitch head. That's a grease-free hitch head. It's also got Alco ATC fitted. Um, that's a like a trailer control. So if you get a strong wind or a big lorry goes zooming past you and your caravan starts to move, that makes the caravan more stable. As we go around the outside, we can see this is where we put the water. So you'd put your water feed pipe into your aqua roll and that will draw the water into the caravan. It doesn't come with any accessories, so a, a trip to our shop is vital. It's got Audi heating, and this is the flue for the heating system. It can accommodate two 6 kg gas bottles. The previous owner has left a motor mover on it. Um, the caravan comes with a 12 month Dunamot warranty, but it doesn't cover that. Fridge vents. toilet flush fill point and the toilet cassette. As we go around the back of the caravan you can see that it's got this easy use grab so if you didn't want to push it anywhere you'd use that to push it into position. As we come around this side you can see we've got this rail here with openings in it. This is the awning rail so you'd feed your awning through and they come in various sizes so you can have a porch somewhere to leave your wellies and your wet coat or you can go for a medium sized one that would cover part of the side of the caravan somewhere where you can put your table or chairs or you can have a full one that will give you an entire new room. Our shop team are excellent and they'll fill you with loads of ideas about which awning could work for you. Here is an external three pin socket and an aerial point and here is where you connect the mains electricity to the caravan. The caravan will work off grid, but none of your three pin sockets will work unless you're plugged into the mains. Here is a storage area which has got a plastic lining. And if we look to the side here, you can see a red key. That red key is for the motor mover. So if you don't switch that on, it won't work. And here is your gas barbecue point. So we're going to take a look inside. Come on, Wend. Here you will see we've got a fly screen on the door and it's the stable door effect. So for me personally, that would keep my little border terrier nice and safe yeah. inside, but you'd still be able to get ventilation in. As we step into the caravan, you will see that it's got plastic on our carpet. So when you come in, you can have a look around and feel the splendor of this. Um, and underneath the carpet, um, it lifts in sections. It's got a nice line, no effect floor. So to the front here, you will see that we've got this superb lounge area. So it's a wonderful space with the big panoramic windows at the front. So you've got the height of the window there so you can see and get lots of daylight in. Above here, we've got two cupboards. Stereo would fit into that one there. And you can see we've got the speakers. And in here, either side, we've got two big cupboards. And this here is a TV aerial. Yeah. My tip to your TV aerial is when you're on site, have a look to see which direction everybody else's aerial is pointing. Yeah. And you can direct yours to match theirs. We've got an occasional table at the front. And here you've got two good sized drawers and also storage below. This area turns into a double bed simply by pulling the bed slats out to the end and turning the cushions upside down. And you can also, as you can see, sleep as single should you wish. The kitchen area has got a work surface extension which easily lifts up and down. We've got the Aldi heating control here, light switches and two electrical sockets. So you can actually touch, tuck your kettle out of the way if you yeah. prefer electric kettle. The kitchen has got two, three, sorry, good sized drawers. Inside there is the sink cover and the draining board. And it's not a drawer, it's a cupboard. And inside there to the right, you'll see that we've got the gas isolation. Yeah. A good sized kitchen cupboard here, plate storage and mug storage. 
It has a microwave fitted that again will only work when you're plugged into the mains. An electric ring, three gas rings and a separate grill and oven. As we turn around here and we look up, we can see the easy use control panels and even more storage. Perfect place here for the TV. And here, this is one of my favorite layouts. And I would actually feel quite tempted to buy this myself. Yeah, this has nice. got the dinette. So this will actually sleep three people. So this is a three birth caravan. But for me, I've not got children, but make the bed up and then you can sit here and it just makes everything so much easier. I'll be having a discussion with Wendy in a little while how much this is for sale for. <laughs> Good size fridge freezer with a freezer compartment that can be removed. And above here, again, we've got additional storage. This is your wardrobe. And inside the wardrobe, you'll see the Audi expansion tank. Yeah. And in here is where your freestanding table stored. That's great because you can use it outside. So when you do load your caravan up, a couple of chairs will do it and use a table outside. The washroom is fantastic. The more I go around this caravan, the more I actually think I might like it myself. Um, an amazing storage cupboard yeah. there for your bathroom bits and also one there as well. Yeah. It's got the skylight and in here, look, you've got plenty of lights. It's a very bright caravan. And it's even got a mood light above the mirror. Yeah. Toilet roll holder and toilet flush. And believe it or not, a wash basket. Yeah. They always put one of those in, don't they? I like those and they look small but you can fit loads in. Yeah. The showers of a good size as well. Easy closed door yeah. and you can adjust the head of the shower should you wish to. Mm. I like this. It's nice. It is, really is nice. So um, if I was you I'd get over to our name up pretty damn quick because um, I'll be uh, seeing what price I can change my caravan for towards this one. Um, so come over to Don Amot Leisure Kingdom. If it's still for sale, have a closer look at it. My name's Claire and I'd love to help you with it. So I'll see you on site.